Welcome back guys to another episode of Young Boy Ranching. Today I'm gonna invite you to come along with me and see a day in the life of a 14 year old rancher. Let's go. So what y'all saw me just do there is I was feeding. And you can see but right there there's my Cheryl, the white cow, coming out and eating. So we're gonna try and push Donnie out get him to come eat too or her her they're both heifers so I'm just gonna try and get him to come eat because if he, she don't eat then she won't get any bigger then she won't be any worth any more when it's time to sell her so we're just gonna go in here and push her out get her to go eat Where is she? Huh. I do not see her. That is not good. Where is that dumb cow? Did she come over here? I swear, if she came over here, I'm gonna be mad. Cause now I gotta chase her all the way back down. She's not in there. Oh, cause she's right there. I don't know if you can see her, but she's right there, right along next to Cheryl. Okay. All right, guys. So we're just gonna get some water flowing here. Probably help if turned on so it can flow. Oops. That was close. Just gonna feel the water, make sure it's cold. And we're gonna fill this bucket up. So, let's just get this water in there. Then we'll head back and that will be it for the morning. that all right so we got feed and water done they're all fed all right guys so it's about two o'clock now and we're gonna do some chores around here in the mornings i know i don't do much because on sundays you know wake up at seven have breakfast and then by the time you have breakfast we have to go to church so we go there then we went out for lunch and now we ran a few errands so now finally getting home and we can get some chores done around here and the one we're trying to tackle today is this limb fell down so I'm just gonna try and clean it up <clears throat> try 
try and make a dent in it. Hmm. Wonder how I'm gonna do this. I got loppers and a shovel and gloves and a wagon. Sure, I'm gonna need more, but I'll find out as I go. I'll probably just eat my way from down here, just eat my way up there. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. So, I'm gonna do a time lapse and I'll catch y'all when I'm either gonna stop for today or done. So, let's do it. Alright, guys, so I'm editing this video and I thought I might as well do a voiceover right now because. I don't really know what to do with the time lapses, and I don't want it to be silence because that's kind of boring. And I know people don't want to watch that, so this is really just me trying to cut this tree down, this limb. And I really just like cleaned up the little sprout like type things, like the smaller branches limbs off of it so I had the main base of the thing and then I just cut that down from there so I think yeah here's the first load done all right guys we're making good progress here so there's that I'm gonna take this down to the road so the city will take it away. Then I'm gonna go switch batteries in the GoPro, get a water, and we'll get back to work. Now, this video took a long time to make, so I'd really appreciate it if you liked and subscribed, or maybe comment some other stuff you would like to see in the future. It's really difficult coming up with ideas for these videos all the time. And this one took a while. Like, of course it took all day, but it came together on a certain day because I couldn't really do a whole day on any other day because we had stuff going on. So this video took a good amount of time to make, and I would appreciate it if you... Like and subscribe. Okay. So. We have gotten close to done. And I'm just about ready to chop that tree limb down. In fact, that's what I'm trying to do right now. I'll tell you right now. Do not try this at home. I am a trained professional. I'm going to hop up here. Like this. Drop it down. This bit of the tree is still alive, so it's pretty difficult. This ain't going too good. my way so you just break that off like so and you push it that way and that's how that's done
little more difficult than I thought, but we still got it done. So now, I'm gonna just go ahead and chop it up, put it in the wagon, and we'll be done with this. Then we mow grass later. Let's do it. Wrong side for the button. All right, it's about four o'clock and it's about, it feels like it's hot and nice. So we're going for a little swim. I feel good. We'll probably just do water, giving water to the cows, and they can hang, and that's it. So, I'll catch y'all when we do that. All right, guys. So, <clears throat> it's about 5:15 on the dot right now, <clears throat> and we're going to water. So. Day has almost come to a close. Um, I guess this video will come out tomorrow when I'm filming. Don't look like the moo moos are out. I don't blame them to feel like it's 109. So. It's so nice when I hit that little downhill there and it just coasts with me. Right. Pool felt great. Felt great. That's probably not good for it. Oh, that's not good. <sighs> Put half in there and then rest in there. All right. So, what we have to do today yet is we have to cut that grass to make some hay. Alright guys, so it's about 7 o'clock now. Yeah, 7 o'clock. And we're out here to feed for the night feeding. We got dummy smacking his gum in my face. So... He ought to scare them away for us. I actually don't think they're in there. I think they're at the top up there. <sighs> I'll video you doing it. You can like narrate and talk about the. <sighs> Alright. Dummy doesn't know how to work the GoPro. So he turned it off. But... Alright, 
Alright, let's go find the cows and chase them down here. So I can eat. Do you just spread it out or just leave it like that? I'll leave it like that. You just spit all over me. You're welcome. <clears throat> None got on me. I do not. Yeah, see they're back in there. You see them? Yeah. Oh, oh my god! Big grasshopper. Mm. See, I pushed all that back up. Oh, that's cool. Well, I hope they're back here. Yeah, they're right there. Hey, Mumos. Go get some food. Go. No, tell him to stop it. Stop. Alright, they're gone. <clears throat> Crab, he probably chased them. Idiot. Stop. You let the professionals do it. Hey, mommy, you can't say that word. Shut up. Are they down there? Go check. Oh, that should be now. Going. Oh, oh yeah. What? Jeez. All right, they're out there. Tom, let's go. It's a little cottontail. A what? Cottontail rabbit. Oh. Yeah, I thought it was like a snake or something. That's cool. Deck webbit. There's a lot of rabbits out here. So guys, it's about <clears throat> 7.40 and we got the mower out. We're gonna cut this grass and then we're gonna put it in that wagon over there that we're using earlier to haul the limbs from that tree away. And then we're gonna dump that somewhere and let it dry. Then we're gonna feed it to the cows tomorrow, hopefully. I'm gonna set you on time lapse, so let's get it. All right, so this is another long time lapse. It's really just me mowing, so it's kind of boring. I really have never used this bagger before, like once. So it took me a while to get used to it and like how long it took to fill up. But I got the hang of it soon enough. Oh. This hay really isn't, you know, anything fancy. It's just whatever grass we had in our yard here. So just kind of going in circles, round and round. Just got that bagger picking it all up. We do end up with a good amount of hay. And it's not... Like I said, you know, any alfalfa or any stuff, but it's still quality stuff that the cows can eat. So, I'm happy we got some of that, especially since we haven't gotten rain in like a month. So, there still ain't going to be rain for like another month, so there's going to be no, no grass at all for a while. It looks like Punt the bikes back now. I think the clip's done right about now. Yeah. Alright, guys, so we're done mowing the grass. And this is what we turned out with. I mean, it's not no alfalfa or anything, but it's not bad grass. It's purdy. So I just let this dry out. Probably tomorrow. And then we'll feed, feed it to the cows. It's a uh, 803, so I think 
that'll wrap it up. All right, so that was the day in the life of a young rancher. Uh, if you like the video, like it and subscribe. And I'll see y'all next time.